everybody made the first welcome to Scarborough today. In the news, former model Wendy Crawford drops in at Pope John Paul Secondary School, and Scarborough separate schools receive over $26 million from the provincial government to relieve overcrowding. And on the way in sports, we have lots of high school action, including highlights from flag football and soccer. We'll get to all that in a moment, but first, today's news. In July of 1984, Wendy Crawford's modeling career was cut short when she was involved in a tragic automobile accident. The driver of the other car was impaired, and Wendy was left a quadriplegic. Since then, she's been working with Metro Police, speaking to high school students about the dangers of drinking and driving. Wendy is retiring from the program at the end of the school year, and today she made her final appearance at a Scarborough school. Following a tour of Metro Toronto by air, Wendy Crawford landed safely at Pope John Paul Secondary School amid fanfare and boisterous cheers. Did you to say? Hell no! It was a reception that both amazed and touched her deeply. Uh, I don't know what to say. <laughs> Thank you very much. I'm real. I didn't know that we were going to have this kind of assembly today. Uh, thanks to the cheerleaders, the band, the stuff there, <laughs> everything. Over the past 13 months, this courageous 22-year-old has made hundreds of appearances, warning students about the dangers of drinking and driving. And her message is working. Statistics show that in that time, alcohol-related traffic accidents in Ontario have dropped by 30%, particularly among teenagers. Okay, well, I know a lot of people who do, like, you know, have a few beers and then they drive off. But, um, like, I'm, I'm going to just tell them from now on, like, if you're going to be doing that, like, stay away from me. And if you guys, if I see any of my friends doing it, I'm going to try and stop them, you know. So. Well, Wendy says she has no definite plans for the future, aside from her impending marriage. She says she'll always be involved one way or another in spreading the message that drinking and driving don't mix. Metro Chairman Dennis. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 